Hey everyone, this is your captain speaking, and welcome to the Mortuary Assistant. This game has been out for a couple months, but after seeing that a lot of other YouTubers are playing it now, including uh, Game Grumps and of course Markiplier and Jacksepticeye and all the big ones several weeks ago, uh, I figure it's it's an appropriate time to try it out. Let's begin our new shift. I have a feeling it's going to be the night shift, though. Why in God's name would you ever do a mortuary job at midnight is uh, anyone's guess. It doesn't make sense to me. Especially if your shift runs into the 3 a.m. witching hour. Of course, I don't believe in such things, so we should be fine. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field. There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that I'm proud of you. I really am. In the demo, it didn't have uh, so, animations at the beginning. You haven't told me what's next. No, I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. What an odd way to hold that cup. But I wanted to give you this anyway. Ooh, so, is it my birthday? Here. It'll keep you safe. I, I don't know if I want that. Just it couldn't it hurt. Please. Thanks. That was abrupt. All right. Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. I've actually been there for a few weeks now. My review well, is tomorrow. There's my first customer. Riverfields Mortuary. Not much of a field if it's covered in rivers. Here we go. Ooh, I can drink coffee. Fuck. Oops. Pick that back up. Oh, you have to hold it down. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so how do I pour this? Do I have to make it first? Oh, I'm never going to be able to get that back straight on this thing, so uh, I think we're going to have to skip coffee for tonight. Oh, well, I guess we'll... Uh, oh. Is this a religious figure? Is that Mother Mary? Is it like gothic Mother Mary? Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give you. Uh, please grab a pencil from the desk at my desk and sign uh, thanks. Sign thanks? Why would I sign thanks? There's the pencil. Used to sign the paperwork left by the door. Okay. Um, oh, God. Uh, quick inventory, right? Okay. S pencil. Done. Wow. Okay. Why the ominous music, though? We, we know what this job entails. We know that we, this is what we're going to be doing. We know it deals with dead bodies. Rebecca, great. Perfect timing. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Moving the deceased. Getting right into it, by the way. Uh, no training or anything. He just assumes that I've worked at mortuaries my entire life. E to use gurney. Okay. Do I have to look at him the entire time? This is painfully slow. Cold storage. To bring a body in or out of the cold storage, open the bay with the body's name, pull out the rack, then move the cart over to it. Let's wheel this over here. Let go of Gurney. Open Oswald's door. Pull the tray out. Right. Grab him with E. Okay. And then put him right here. And then push. Gently push. Or drag. All the way. All the way. All the way. Like that. Put this down, move this out of the way, and close. And lock very tightly. There is no lock. That is a fault in the designer's design. And grab Dorothy Page. Oh, God. Okay. Grab. There we go. Easy enough. All right. This is so slow. I guess they are kind of heavy. Even if they are dead. This one's going to start blinking. Yeah. For an old lady, she's uh she's kept pretty strong. She went to the gym every day. All right. I'm just finishing up something here. So why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks? Okay. I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. Why would you get out of my way when I'm done? Why don't you get out of my way now? Actually, you're not even in my way. I don't know what we're talking about. Space to view clipboard. Okay. Dorothy Page, 87. She lived a long life. Probably because she kept in shape. Inspecting the body. Hovered the cursor over unique part markings such as moles, scratches. But why would we need to know about moles? Identifying the corpse. We know who she is already. Scratches, bruises, and interact with them to record them to the clipboard. Okay. Rotate. There's a mole. Here's a weird uh, predator shot. She, she was... Okay. We figured out how it happened. She was shot by predator. She doesn't seem like the type that would be armed, though. Maybe she was armed with her fists. Uh, another um, liver spot, okay. 
teeth are a little gnarly, uh, but I imagine that's because they don't keep the dentures in. Hmm. These old windows never stay latched. Well, that's that's great. Can we nail it down then? <gasps> Ooh, interesting. Scratches on her palm. So are we are trying to figure out how she died. Are we doing an autopsy or what? Huh. More predator marks. Very strange. What uh, what are they saying about these? Keratosis, I guess. Right? Is that what we're talking about? What you working on? You're just scribbling on one line. You're not even doing anything. Does it take you that long to sign your name? No wonder he's trying to find someone to work with him. He doesn't do anything all day. Let's leave that open. It's getting a little musky in here. Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Climb on in here. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet. From Thank God. I thought that, he... We'll get started. I thought he was still sitting down. He's like, climb, climb on over here and we'll uh, we'll get some work done. To enter cadav cadaver information. Don't die here. What was that? I didn't say anything. You all right? E yeah. No. I'm fine. What the fuck Sorry. was that? I'll die here? What kind of accusation is that? Who even said that? Right arm. Rash. Left arm. Abrasion. That was on her hand, though, but okay. I feel like you need to be a little more specific about that kind of thing. Right leg is also keratolysis. Keratol keratolysis, sorry. Printing it out for the records. You are being very creepy right now. They have no animation on them. That's highly unsettling. Oh god, he's following me. Okay. Ooh. Is this important? What is this? Uh, Embalming report. Crap, hold on. I was supposed to grab the paper, wasn't I? Thanks. Uh, a packet of mortuary paperwork. Uh, files up the front so they're available. Okay, I'll be right back. Just stand there. Don't move. Okay, and put the papers. Time to embalm. Oh, yay. My favorite part. All right. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Everything's yeah. on your list there. I see that. I see that's all you're going to do. This window is going to slam on my fingers, isn't it? Is this moist moisturizing wipe? Do I need that first? A wipe used to moisturize the skin of the deceased large item. Do I wipe her down? What's the, uh, what do I do first? Is there a, a instruction manual? Because you act like I've done this before. I literally have no idea anything about, uh... Autopsies or mortuaries or funeral homes or anything, sir. If you're going to want me to, if you're going to want me to do my job, you're gonna to have to unlock all the cabinets. I'm gonna need this fast tight like ASAP. What is this? Oh, yay! To suck out the bodily fluids. Setting the face. Oh, I gotta set the face first. Pull the manipulator up and then press the injector button to drive barbs into the skull. Then twist the wires to shut the jaw. Is that so her mouth doesn't open while people are, like, at the wake? Oh, this is helpful. Thanks. Oh, okay, yeah. I got you. Needle injector. Hammering set. Needle barbs. Yeah, that's it. We need that first. Let's drop the, uh... Let's drop this. Did it fall on the floor? Okay, yeah, kind of. It's in here. Why are all these locked? Maybe it's so I don't get even more confused about what I'm doing by adding a lot more items. Oh, here's the needles. Okay, good. Oh, here we go. Is that right? Did I do it correctly? Oh, God. God, I have no idea what I'm doing. Looks like I'm wiring her mouth shut. Oh, God, I guess I am wiring her mouth shut. There we go. Oh, my God. The things people figured out on how to make people not freaked out by their loved ones while they're at their wake. Placing eye caps. Oh, I got those. Yeah, let's do it. Eye caps, yeah. I can't use that here. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm, I'm using eye caps. Oh, what? What? Okay, right. formaldehyde. Wait, is that what we need? Or do, do we need all these? What are we looking for? Where's the list of things to do? Let's start with the first one, I guess. Artificial, artificial. Okay, let's do that. Oh God. Hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly. And, and so they jump across the like wall. Just keep doing your thing. I'll get it. I got the formaldehyde, right? And the glutaraldehyde. Are either, either one of these going in there? Well, I guess so. I guess I'm putting all of them in there. I hope I'm doing this right. The cocktail is done. You s okay, so you said that you were going to get these, but uh, you haven't moved an inch. 
Well, I'm not getting them. Let's start this thing. Let's start it. Let's do it. How do we... Wait, wait. Oh. Oh. Troker. Missing something. Artery forceps. Now Troker. Missing something. Uh, okay, hold on. Do we need it? Oh, I bet we need the tubing. Tubing. Check. Now we can start the pumping. Mm. Oh my god. Is it that fast in real life? How do people not get scarred for life by working at these jobs? Oh god. Did you see that? There is someone else here. Do you have another assistant? Hold on. I would not do this in real life. Must have escaped in the vents. Or in this pizza oven. Don't think that's a good place to escape, sir. I don't think there's any exit in there. Plus, 500 degrees would really hurt. Of course, if this is actually a uh, crematorium, uh, it probably goes up to like 2,000 degrees. So, uh, yeah, he's probably toast. Oh, he might have went through this door right here, honestly. Or he's hiding in one of these. Oswald, are you the one that uh, that's walking around? Uh, he's, he's not dead yet. It's the only logical explanation. Well, there's all the blood. No, it's still coming out. I think that's actually... Do we just lose all of our... Uh, all the juice and stuff I put in this machine? Did that just drain out too? Take the thing out, close the thing back, sew it in a split second, and we're done. Let's keep that closed. Oh. Oh. Troker time. All right. Let's... Oh, God. Oh, my God. Am I supposed to move this? Okay. There we go. No, 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 let's keep those shut. In fact, uh, let's go back to my original suggestion of just nailing them down. I'm gonna get locked in here. Oh, God. A lot of stuff going on. Which one do I take? Are they all the same? The developer of this game either worked at a mortuary, or he did a lot of research in here. Tank in here. Sir, are you are aware that there is a demonic entity uh, terrorizing us as we speak. He's like, yeah, that thing has been here for years and years. It does not bother me anymore. Do you know how hard it is to find another job in this economy? Actually, not not that hard, honestly. What's next? Moisturizing. Finally, something I actually recognize. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. That ha must have some Tell really bad chemicals on it. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Yeah, I thought I melted her face uh, off for a second. Sure, I just got here. Okay, bye. Thanks. Uh, if I don't answer your phone call, that's it's not because I don't want this job. Go ahead. It's fine. I'll give you a call when we get to. Okay. Oh, God. So scared, I spilled my drink everywhere. That came so close to landing on my laptop. Holy shit. Hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I, I need you to come back in to tonight. No, I wanted to apologize. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. If I was called into my job on my day off, uh, I would be pissed. Ooh, ooh, donut stuff. I really need some coffee. All right, let's uh, grab the chips and go. Maybe. Where are my keys? God, I always lose those. God, I always lose those. Found them. That was. I thought it was gonna be a scavenger hunt from hell, but I guess not. Let's go. Let's go get the. Let's go embalm some demons. May I just say that uh, working at the mortuary at night during Halloween in the rain, when you know that there is an entity around, is probably the dumbest thing I've ever seen in a video game. All right. Guess I'll head to the back and get started. What? What did I just scream at? What happened? I don't think this was here before, actually, with the original game. Uh, I think they've added this for Halloween. How nice, Mr. Match. That'll come in handy. Burn this place down. All right, all right, I'm here. Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try to stay calm. When the hell did that happen? I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here. Let alone. What did she see that I didn't see? What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. 
Just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just play along. Hazing? Do your job. Hazing. This is a 50-year-old man working in a funeral home. What, what do you mean hazing? We're not in college. Old key. New key. Tape recorder. I still want to know what she saw that we didn't see. Because there's no windows in here. And I got the key. Old key. That's not it. New key. I like how she's now suddenly calm. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me. But I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. Why don't we just burn all the bodies? Burn all the bodies. Right now. Go to the thing and burn the bodies. There's no need to keep... They're all dead. Let's tell the... Tell the owners... The owners. Tell the relatives uh, that it was an accident. We accidentally burned your body. Your your relative's body. And then tell the next person that it was them. They burned their body. No one's going to do any um, police investigation on this. They're already dead. Wow, this guy was really young. That's sad. Oh, I'm sure that's what it is. I don't like how his toes are moving. Thank God he actually did my, did what I suggested and nailed the window shut. Where's my clipboard? Coffee. Oh, they reset the coffee pot. He's got gum on the side of his face. Not sure why we left that on there. Okay. Oh my God. Hello. Oh my God. New job. I'm getting out of here. I don't care how long I went to school. You career path. Fuck this. Yep. She. I didn't have to make any kind of comment. Fine. Yes, I do. 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 No. Screw this. I'm getting back to work. Yeah. Screw these ghosts. Age twenty six. Head. Him and him and Jumi Joma. What? 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 I need to file the copy up front. Yeah, just stay calm about this situation. The fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Was that pineapple? Nope. She seems fine and dead. Okay, let's go file that paperwork. Alright, uh, embalming report. Uh, it's time to embalm. Yeah. We're gonna leave it here. This is scary as fuck. Very well crafted. And apparently one guy made it. So yeah, definitely worth the play. This guy did a great job. In the next couple of days, we'll do another episode. And uh, I guess this is a good lead up to Halloween. What? What? I was doing an exit. I was doing an outro. What was that? I am here. Was I timed? Am I being timed? And if I don't do it in time, I'm going to be stabbed? I'm going to be possessed? At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you. We're going to end it here before uh, we lose any more time. Anyway, if you guys like that video, please hit like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay toasty, everybody. See ya.